upon you. And Navi, thanks for hosting and I'm uh, very humbled and honored to be here. Um, I think, I know we only have one minute, but enough has been said about all what's going on and what's happened in Chapel Hill. To me, I think the most important thing is us as Muslim community, we need to take a step further and be more inclusive. Be more inclusive into things. We all need to remember we're in America. America is probably still the most greatest place to live. We, most of us that come from, I'm from Pakistan, have more religious freedom here in America than we do back home. So we should keep that in mind. And we should keep that in mind that why and how this happened. And what, you know, the preaching, like Michael said, and Michael's a good friend of mine, Islam, we should portray what real Islam is. We should dialogue with people. We should not hide behind closed doors that I'm a Muslim or my wife covers my head and I cannot show her, I, I'm ashamed of it now. We should put a religion out there for people to see what a beautiful and peaceful religion it is. What a, a best man Prophet Muhammad is. You know, and Islam is not what ISIS tells us and Islam is certainly not what Fox News tells us either. So there is the real Islam that we need to put out there. So I think the onus is on Muslims more than anybody else to step forward and actually go have an outreach with people. I've met Jeff Rising, he's come to Dover, we met him, and how it happened is we had a, and it's a shame to tell you the story, but we had a burglary in our masjid in Dover. So we called state police and state police jumped all over it and they were so nice and Jeff was kind enough to come to Dover and sit down with us and we thought we got burglarized and hate crime and all this and that. So when we sat down with state police, the first thing the captain told us, he said, we don't even know where you are, who you are. So this is state police telling us in Dover that we don't, know, we don't even know who you are and where you're located because you know what, we never made an effort to go out there and tell people we're Muslims and we're out here and come join us. So since that day, the state police in Dover actually comes to our Ramadan gatherings. They know us, we know them, we have any problem, we're with there, they're with us. So please be inclusive, come out there, preach, not go preach forcefully, but show it with your actions, who we are, how we act, how we behave, how we stand in a grocery line and how we act. Are we the one to push people out of the way and, and then say, oh, look, there's a Muslim right there. Or we're the one who's gonna help that lady take the grocery to her car and then she says, oh, you know, I saw a Muslim today. She actually helped me with the grocery bag. So that's all I just pray is please, let's show everybody what the real Islam is. Thank you.